I just got off the plane and I found this cute little place to eat. Here's what I like to do. I'm doing a video. <laughs> it's gonna be on YouTube. <laughs> so what I like to do when I get to Rome is immediately, I don't care what time it is, go out to dinner. Could be 10, 30, 11. I'm gonna find a place and I'm gonna have dinner. And I found this cute little place. It was highly rated. Um, and I'm staying in a new place. Now, the reason there's not many people here is the pandemic. Now, there were some other places that I passed by. There's lots of good places in this neighborhood by the train station. So I did a new thing this time. I took the train from the airport and felt like a real local because, um, why pay 60 dollars 60 euros for a taxi when you can take the train for 14 very pleasant got off got to my hotel room and then i don't really feel i'm in rome until i have dinner and um so it's a little slow tonight thursday because um there's not that many people around but i did see a bunch of places i want to try i don't think i'm going to be moving out of this neighborhood i'm glad i came early because um Highly recommend. This is the only place I ever do this in Rome is when I get here, go out to dinner, have a glass of wine, relax. My Casio de Pepe is coming. So very short video. I'm going to show you when it comes. Um, already making friends here. Nice Gail, the waitress, is from um, the DR, Dominican Republic. So... Super happy to be in Rome after 18 hours of travel. I'm almost human. <laughs> I don't think I can do those 11 hour flights so easily. I was kind of panting. That's never happened to me before. It was just like, this is too much. Um, anyway, oh, what do we got here? Something's coming. So I walked in here, I said, so where is everybody? They said, well, it's just a little slow tonight, but hey, it's highly rated. I got to try this Casio de Pepe. It's, de Pepe. it's a pasta vermicelli with pepper. So, yum. Oh, that looks so good. Oh, you got some over there. Mmm. <laughs> Thank you. Yum.